What is up, you guys? It's Balti bringing you another video, and how are you doing? I have not brought you guys a video in a long time, and I'm so sorry about that. And this is no video saying that I'm coming back, because I might not be back. I just have been enjoying playing Vanguard. Felt like this is a video I haven't seen yet, and you guys might want to see it. So we are going to get into talking about how to get uh, basically gold or any of these camo challenges done. The main ones being... Death artists, uh, the death minded and survivalists. I uh, will get into that right now. Actually, let's go. Right, yeah, guys. So those challenges being the death artist, I mean, oh yeah, death artists, mind games, and survivalist challenges. I've already completed obviously mind games, and I'm working on death artists now. I just wanted to show this video to you guys because I feel like you don't understand or know what you need, and I haven't seen a video that describes it well. Um, yes, you need videos with these certain attachments, but no, they do not have to be the only attachments you use. As you can see, I'm using Slate Reflector. None of them say you can use Slate Reflector, but I use it. We are currently uh, really close to getting gold for the MP40 here. So whenever we get it gold, that'll be great. But let's go ahead and hop into a game. We're going to be playing some Demyansk. I don't know how to say these names. Well, let's get into it. I use Death Artists. Uh, I've been trying to get these because they're headshots. But I'm actually going to use a not mine game. I have all the survivalists because these are the long shots. And this is a perfect map to maybe get these long shots from this window. Pretty much anything up here down, down to the bottom is a one long shot. If I find myself pushing more... I'll switch back. So yeah, I mean, technically on the channel, a lot of cut comms are coming, just because I like watching these type. So yeah, I enjoy uh, po uh, watching this type of content, and I like posting Call of Duty, but this is not going to be anything super serious. Like, I'm just going to do it as a hobby. If it takes off, it takes off. If it does, it does. Try to do a video every day. We'll see how it goes. Oh my gosh, he knifed me. Because I try, I fix the jumping in the game, boys, please. But yeah, so this is just going to be some cut comms and challenge videos. Like this one's going to be how to get gold on your MP40. Uh, and a lot more uh, guns whenever I get them closer to gold, you'll see those videos. I haven't played Call of Duty in forever. Like, I, I played Cold War, uh, but I didn't play it as long as it was out if that makes sense so i haven't played in a long well not a long long time like it hasn't been years or anything but it's been a good amount of time and uh i came over to this game and i just loved it uh, i die a lot I, st I started off terrible because i had to get back used to con and first person shooters because i haven't played a first person in a, as long as i haven't played this so um it was definitely different at first, but now I'm kind of getting back into the swing of it. I don't do way really good like I used to, but I don't do awful either. And uh, now I'm doing these challenges. I think I did uh, Road to Diamond or Road to Dark Matter on Black Ops 4. Um, and I did one video with the MX-9, and it really seemed to kick off. People really liked it. And with this game being newer and stuff, I, I thought I'd do you know, a little mini series I'll do where I just try to get gun gold and then maybe once I get like a few more gold, I'll get diamond and stuff. But for now, we're just going to get certain guns gold and that'd be that. Uh, both challenge wise and just regular playing, I have a great MV40 class and I'm definitely going to be trying out more MV40 classes and stuff and just other guns. Like, at first, I really liked the STG-44. Like, that was a gun that I found myself using. That should have been a headshot. I should have got a quick headshot. Guys, I cannot stress this enough. If you're doing these challenges where you need headshots, at least get the easy ones. When people are just standing there, there should be easy headshots. And I never seem to actually get them. Not nearly at the skill level I was at when I caught uh, on Cold War. I was playing a lot of ranked. Tried out for team, pro teams and stuff, and 
and now I'm not yet there. I started playing a lot more Fortnite, as you can see on the channel. Um, another thing, talking about the game, uh, main problems that I have seen are... I don't know. The main problems are like just simple fixes that can happen throughout the game that really don't necessarily hinder my experience playing the game, but they I could see where they get in the way to some people's enjoyment. Uh, certain things such as yeah, oh. Just certain things like if you're a challenge hunter, you can't do a lot of the challenges for guns right now. Uh, or at least you couldn't. I don't know if it's been fixed yet or not. But a lot of guns you can't do challenges on. Uh, another thing that is really broken is... Not broken necessarily, it just needs to be fixed. Is, uh... People in the game, like... I, just, I get into too many games for it to be brand new. Where if I'm in a party of three, it's just me and my party. It's no one else, so... Um, that is frustrating for sure, but I don't know. I really enjoyed the game. So, I mean, I'm not going to sit here and say I hate it. And there's so many things that need to be fixed. There are bugs. There are things that are still kind of, you know, developing as the game does. I mean, it just got released. So it isn't like obviously going to be perfect. And, uh, yeah, I mean, once... You know, you get a, used to it, and they, you know, Sledgehammer's last game was World War II, I believe. So, once they get used to it, you know, get back into the swing of things and have time to fix it. The game came out November 5th or 6th, and, you know, I don't know a game that's came out and been perfect right off the launch. I mean, do I lag as much on this game as... Do I lag as much on this game as I do on other CODs? No. I feel like this game has the least, least amount of lag than a COD that I've... CODs I've played in the past, which is, in my opinion, is super good. I hate laggy games, as anyone would. Nobody likes playing games that are super laggy or, you know, you can't even get into it without going a 100 miles a second like and uh you know as patches come out new maps come out and they get an actual battle pass for this game i will enjoy it way more but i hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to smash the like button subscribe and comment what you want to see on the channel if you even care to watch anything else on this channel let me know definitely more videos like this coming out new uh yeah all types of new videos coming out on this game i'm just gonna like i said post them uh cut comms all type of stuff so i hope you enjoyed and yeah i'll see you in the next one peace